Today's video is made possible by Hulu Plus. All right, glad to see you guys here once again on Tech of Tomorrow. So what's on the plate today? Well, you guys all know that AMD has released their 290X, but the card that originally came out had their stock cooling. It was kind of iffy on overclocking and stuff due to its heat and how loud it was. Well, now we're gonna see the next generation of cards begin to come out and we have our hands on the latest Gigabyte WinForce Edition. That's right. So this is a WinForce Edition, features their triangle cooling. It's the 450 watt version. This thing's tricked out, overclocked out of the box, and geared to be for an enthusiast who wants performance. So with that said, let's take a look at the box and what's inside of it and see what's in store for you with Gigabyte's latest entry into the 290X market. All right, folks, so here we have it, the box in its normal little square form factor here. Gigabyte, WinForce 450 watt out, OC Guru 2 Radeon R9-290X with four gigabytes of GDDR5, so you know it's gonna be really fast. On the side of the box, it shows you basically it does AMD iFinity, four gigs, 512-bit memory interface, DirectX 11, 28 nanometer process, and the back of the box, which just basically tells something about their triangle cooling. So I'm just gonna move on. You guys told me you could give a rat's ass about the box, so I'm gonna move past the box as you guys have requested. So, get it out of there, get it off to the side. Got the old Gigabyte logo once again in a little black box, the boxception. We'll pop the cap on that. That all peeled back. See the card? All nice and sealed up. Actually though, folks, to be honest, this card probably was already opened. I believe that uh, the entire time at CES, Gigabyte had all these cards on display, so it's probably been opened once before. Here inside, we see a little container and absolutely positively nothing else in the box. So yeah, this was probably one of the samples that Gigabyte actually used on their tour. So I'll toss that out of the way, not much to look at. So in that case, let's just get right to the meat and potatoes, the video card. Just pop a little strap there. And then we shall pull this thing out. All right, so let's just start off on the back of the card. Now, personally, I think this could have been done just a little bit better. You guys, I know you like it and I like it. I really love when there's a shroud covering the back of the card. Sometimes these components can cut you or they can just, you know, be touched and short the card out. I prefer it when it has that back panel. Down here in the bottom, we have the PCI insertion. I'm gonna flip it to the side where you guys can see some of the cooling. We also see a single six pin, single eight pin power connector right there. I'm gonna flip it over just once again so you guys can see the side. Inside also, you can see all of the copper heat pipes, they're all in there, helping dissipate all that heat away from the card. We see three fans, Triforce. Three fans underneath that. Once again, you guys can see all of the cooling. The nomenclature of the card is clearly shown right there. Flip it around to the I.O. Two DVI, standard display port, standard HDMI. Nothing too unusual there. You guys can see back of the card, and that's pretty much it, folks. Like I said, the big deal about this card, the really big deal about this card is the aftermarket cooling. We all know the 290X has been out. We've seen the results. We all agreed that, hey, the damn thing needed to be water-cooled or have an aftermarket cooler. So, hey, Gigabyte's just taken the next step in the evolution of the card, added this external cooling. So now we'll throw it on a test bench. We'll find out how well this works compared to the standard 290X and bring that news to you. But that's pretty much it, folks. This is the card, the new R9 290X WinForce Edition from Gigabyte. So so, all right, there you have it, folks. Everything that comes in the box in this brand new Gigabyte 290X overclocked WinForce Edition video card. Now, I know people out there have been waiting for a long time for these to come out. And right now, things are a little bit trippy with pricing from AMD. Do the whole Bitcoin mining and all that stuff. You can see the price have gone up and out the roof. This card's hitting almost the $700 mark. That's right, so it is very expensive. But for those people out there who are AMD fans and could give a shit less about top performance, this is something you're gonna wanna get your hands on. Now, before I bounce out of here, I just wanna thank Hulu for making today's video possible. So I know many of you PC users out there know what Hulu is, but do you guys really know what Hulu Plus is? Because Hulu Plus is like a whole different level. Hulu Plus is like taking that standard video card 
card, slapping a water cooler on it, and getting the absolute most bang for your buck. Just all kinds of content. Now, with the standard Hulu, you can only watch it on your PC. But with Hulu Plus Baby, you can take that on the go, on your tablet, on your phone. With Hulu Plus, you can catch up on current shows, binge on old favorites, or watch a great movie. Stream as many TV shows and movies as you want, anytime, anywhere. You can also check out exclusive content including Hulu originals like The Wrong Mans and Behind the Mask. Best of all, you can watch all of this content in HD. Now, I know a lot of people always ask, how can you guys support the site? Well, at this time, you can support the site and get your guys a free extended trial period just by going to HuluPlus.com forward slash T-O-T, where you can enjoy Hulu Plus for two weeks. Like usual, folks, all the information for this video, everything will be down there below the like button, which I know you're gonna kung fu hit in the description box. And if you like what you see, hey, hit that like button. Also, if you wanna be subscribed to our channel and get this stuff every day in your news box, hit the button over here so you can be sub to Tech of Tomorrow and never miss out on any of our tech goodness. See you later.